What's up guys, I'm back with a brand new video and in this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to get the ultra dark mode on your Samsung Galaxy S9 Plus. And by ultimate, I mean super ultimate from UI to icons to settings to messages applications to keyboard to Instagram. Yes, freaking Instagram in dark mode. This, like I said, is going to be the ultimate ultra dark mode. I've actually been using this on my Galaxy S9 Plus for quite some time, maybe for about a month. And finally, I'm sitting down to make this video for you guys and how to get it on your phone as well. Now, in case you don't know, the S9 Plus is my go-to Android phone along with my iPhone 10. Just like the old days, I use whatever the latest iPhone that it is around along with the latest Galaxy phone. But of course, we cannot do these customization on the iPhone 10, even with the iOS 12. Uh, so this is where I really like Android and Samsung in particular. Now, before I begin the tutorial, I want you to know that this will work on other Samsung phones as well. So if you have a Galaxy S8, S8 Plus or Galaxy Note 8, it will work fine and even some of the OnePlus phones and along with some Google Pixel phones are supported as well. Getting the ultra dark mode for your Samsung smartphone is super beneficial, especially if you have a Galaxy S9 Plus because it will help you when it comes to battery life because Samsung's AMOLED displays are really good when it comes to the dark pixels. So you should be able to retain some battery using this setup. So like I said, this is the ultra dark mode. First, we're gonna talk about how to get the dark mode. Now, there are actually two ways to do it. First one is the basic one. All you have to do is to go to your theme engine and from that you need to download this theme called as black uh, M-I-N-U. This is a complete black theme like completely pitch black theme. Every part of the UI goes completely black with no colors whatsoever. So this is a theme that I chose. There's actually a second one as well which is called as dark marble. This is actually colorful in some areas such as the phone dollar or if you go into the messaging application. So for me it's not truly the dark that I'm looking for so definitely the black one and this is like I said the basic way to have dark mode on your Samsung phone so when you apply this theme your lock screen will go completely black this is how your home screen will going to look so it's completely black again no wallpaper whatsoever really good set of app icons as well uh, if you go into the full app drawer you can see it looks really incredible black search tab black quick toggles the settings UI also looks pretty good completely dark with colorful icons on the sides of course Course, this is to make things easier when you're navigating through the settings. You can easily go to whatever setting you want by looking at the icon. So for lock screen, we have that easy lock. This is how the multitasking tray looks. And you also get a completely dark keyboard. Now this was the basic dark mode that you can get on your Samsung phone by just applying a theme. Nothing ultra about it. The problem with this is that it only works with the stock system based stuff. So if you open up Instagram, this is how it's going to look. All your most used application for me is the Instagram as well as WhatsApp or YouTube, those stuff will still remain white. And that kind of spoils the fun of this theme. I mean, Samsung really has to do something uh, for the third-party application as well. Uh, you know, having these themes work on the third-party apps such as Instagram, YouTube, or WhatsApp in order to truly have that black theme experience. But unfortunately, we can't have that. And Instagram currently doesn't have any uh, dark mode. I'm actually surprised that there is no dark mode on Instagram yet. We have like million of users right now. So we will see it eventually in the future. So for now, we have to go through this setup to get that dark Instagram experience that we have uh, right now on my Galaxy S9 Plus. As you can see, it looks absolutely incredible. Dark Instagram is gold. And like literally, I use Instagram on my S9 Plus all the time. And this is uh, because of this dark UI. And just imagine how much uh, of battery you are saving like the difference is there compared to the dark or like the bright Instagram the normal Instagram we have so okay so in order to get the ultra dark mode or dark mode with the third party applications as well you need to rely on this application which is called as Substratum and this app is pretty much the theme engine for your Samsung phone 
and get applied on the third-party applications that you want on. And if you have root access, then you can pretty much search uh, Substratum themes on Play Store and download any theme you want and apply it. It will work absolutely fine. But chances are you probably don't have root because you don't want to root your phone. You don't want to go through those steps and you don't want to ruin your warranty. So in order to use the Substratum theme engine without root, it will require you to download this application, which is called as a Andromeda. Now Andromeda is a, not a free application from Play Store. You have to pay like some cents. I think it's $1 maybe or less than $1 right now. So you need to have this in order to apply themes from Substratum. So go ahead and launch the Play Store and search for Andromeda. And as you can see, I have already installed it and I bought it, of course. So you have to buy this as well. And of course, if you haven't already, you need to download the Substratum theme engine application as well. And don't worry, this one is free. But once you have these two applications installed, you will see the Andromeda client here on your home screen. Go ahead and launch it and it will say connection status disconnected. So in order to have the connection status connected, you have to download the Andromeda client for your desktop, whether it be Windows or Mac. For that, you need to visit this XDA forum link that I've posted down below in the description. Here you will see all the links. If you're on Windows, download this. If you're on Mac, you can download this one. And so go ahead and open this uh, on your desktop and, and also connect your Samsung phone via USB-C. Tap on the Andromeda client and as you can see it says connection status is disconnected. I'm going to go ahead and select this client, choose and it should work anytime. As you can see it says Andromeda is now binding or has now binded your device and it will say this on your phone. Connection status connected it will turn green which means now you can start theming. So go ahead and launch it and when you launch it for the first time you will see this page as blank which means you have to download themes from the Play Store. So and from Play Store you need to download this theme which is the Swift black substratum theme. Now this is the best dark theme for these third party applications that will work fine without crashing them. Now this is not a free theme. You actually have to pay uh, $1 something for this theme. And I have to say this is the best black theme for substratum that will work with your Samsung phone. You see it works with Snapseed and a bunch of other applications as well. So I'm gonna open up the substratum theme engine and go into the Swift black theme and go ahead and press next and as you can see the list of applications are huge it works with so many apps and the good thing is that they are actually working on bringing the updates as well so as you can see it actually works with uh, the latest version of Instagram you can see the whole list it works with so many apps so to apply this you can turn on this and that will select everything and then select on this and click on install selected. Obviously you have selected everything. And once you do that, it will take a while to finish. And once it's done, you have to install uh, all of this one by one. So it could be a long process, just press done and then keep installing until everything is done. Once the installation is complete, go ahead and restart your Samsung phone. And when it turns back on, everything will go dark. All the applications and the stuff you have selected with will go dark for sure. So uh, you can see Instagram looks great. Same thing with the Snapseed. This is the video or I mean the photo editor that I use to edit my photos. And as you can see, the dark mode is working perfectly on the latest version of the Snapseed application. It also works with Gmail, YouTube, Facebook, WhatsApp. You can try it out on all those apps uh, if you want to. But uh, yeah, this is how you can do the ultra dark mode on your Samsung phone, even with the third party applications. So for that, you can root your phone or better, you can rely on Andromeda, uh, download the Andromeda client and then download the Swift Black theme uh, for doing that ultra dark mode activation. So yeah guys, this is something that I've been using on my S9 Plus for about a month now. And now uh, this is how you can get on your phone as well. Again, it will work on other phone as well. Substratum theme engine supports OnePlus phones, uh, some Huawei phones, and also uh, the Google Pixel phones, some Nexus devices. So you can have uh, fun with those phones as well. Uh, but again, for basic stuff, you can use just the black theme. Uh, so yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Share it with your friends. And I will catch you guys in the next one.
Peace out.